everyone, it's Sonia Farrell here from All Heart by Sonia Farrell and Pets Portraits by Sonia Farrell. Thank you so much for joining me. I am so excited. Oh, <laughs> I'm about to get Axel's portrait off to his mummy. She's been so patient with me because I've had a few things on the go and um, she's just uh, allowed me to do what I needed to do. But in the meantime, I've been also working on getting Axel's portrait uh, finished so I can get it off to his mum. He is the most beautiful, beautiful little pup. Um, Rita has very uh, interestingly uh, chosen to celebrate his portrait in black and white, which is monochrome. It's a, like a really interesting style. Um, it was heaps of fun to do because it really does focus on tones, um, which if you're not into art and stuff, that's that's not like <laughs> As an artist, uh, it was quite a good exercise in terms of, uh, you know, working with tones and, and, and so forth. So um, I really, really enjoyed doing Axel's portrait. He is a gorgeous pup. He seems to be very intelligent, lots of love. Um, the monochrome aspects of it are the black uh, uh, and the white. So the black reminds me and just um, prompts me to think about how clever he is. It's a very smart pup. Um, he seems to have a bit of emotional intelligence as well because he really, really dotes on his mum and his nana and his bestie, Baba. <laughs> So he has a bestie and um, I just, I can just imagine them romping around and playing. Um, but in any case, and then uh, Rita, and I'll bring this, uh, the portrait closer uh, for your um, viewing pleasure. <laughs> um, you'll notice that his, um, his neck band, his collar is in green, um, which is why I'm wearing green. But uh, this sort of signifies in my mind... Um, how he has a love for the outdoors and um, just running and being free. So you can just like, boom, you can just see him doing zoomies everywhere. <laughs> Um, so really, um, this pup lives for his mama and his nana and he's, um, he's just very cute. He has a dash of mischievousness and he has a real, real good ability to be able to share his love with his family. He is enthusiastic and he keeps them entertained. <laughs> with um chasing games and uh you know he plays with the ball and he juggles with his favorite toys and um this all just adds to his charm he's just such a treasured little fur baby and um he has the most longest luscious uh, luscious eye eyelashes so i'll bring that in closer just so you do see that i don't know if you noticed that before but he has these beautiful twirling eyelashes that the groomer keeps um for rita and um he just uh, <laughs> just oh my goodness these animals are just the most beautiful little creatures and um really um this is why i love doing what i do because i get to like um i haven't met uh, axel because he's not in the same kind uh you know town as i am but our city but I can just, uh, um, Rita was very clever. She sent me like a PowerPoint of when he was a baby and all his favorite things and his little neck band and his, you know, all his, you know, the way he uh, rests and wait for them and um, him playing with his toys and um, just the different hairstyles. Like he, he has a shaggy look and then he has the like really groomed look and then, um, and Rita uh, chose um, the one where he's had like the combination, just a little bit more of a grown out look but uh, I love the reference photo she sent so I will um, if you pop onto my website you'll be able to see the reference photos and the and the little story behind Axel's portrait um, I normally do a blog on most of my pet portraits that I do so you'll be able to see those on my on my website so please do go in and have a look so um, that's me for now I'm not going <laughs> to keep you much longer um, but if you are interested in having a pet portrait done um, they are done with non-realistic colors um, Axel's color for example is white and brown um, but the colors are actually typically used and you'll see in um, the other posts that I do the um, portraits uh, are typically really vibrant and vibrant and really loud colors <laughs> and most of the time those colors are quite intuitive in actual fact you can see my palette at the back there this is what I use to get inspired um, let me just show you 
to get inspired with my portraits. So, for example, if um, if you chose aqua for your pup, um, those are the sorts of colors of aqua you're going to get, like in the shades and the tones. So, you know, the deeper colors and so forth. So that gives you an in, uh, indication of all the colors um, that I typically would work for. So our little treasures, <laughs> little gems, are up pets and um and you know so even the colors have some sort of significance so thank you for joining me if you want to find out more about my pet portrait um commissions i do commissions um i have limited spaces only so if you're keen just get in really quickly and and let me know that you're keen my website has all the details www.allhardbysondyfarrell.com and um, you can find out how to get a portrait done of your pet and um thank you for being here to celebrate Axel with me. Um, he is just a gorgeous little boy and um, uh, I wish one day I do actually get to meet him but at the moment it doesn't look like it because he's a bit far away but um, I get to enjoy his life and help share his beautiful life with you as well so that you can see how precious and um, how special he is to his family. Thanks for joining me. All the very best. Have a good one. Keep up. Bye.